All right, YouTube, David Harry here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to update your iPad to iPad OS 16 Beta. Now, this update will work for any compatible iPad. In this instance, I am using an iPad Pro 2021. Now, before I go any further, here is a very boring but big, massive warning which you need to listen to. So, what I've done here, and what I suggest you do as well, is to back up your iPad I've backed it up via the cloud and I would strongly recommend that you do the same okay so to get into this then what we need to do is go to Safari from what I understand I think we can only use Safari to do this so once we are on Safari we need to go to betaprofiles.com okay so that is betaprofiles.com there will be a link in the description below and that will take us to this site which does look very Apple like but this is not an official Apple site as we can see here, there are a number of files which can be downloaded for various Apple products and whatnot here, as we can see on Mac as well. But what we're interested in is the iPad OS 16. And don't forget, this is the beta. So what we need to do is have a look here where it says iPad OS. And then where it says install profile, we're going to click on install profile. So we'll tap on there. Now it's going to tell us a few things here. You can read through that. But anyway, I'm going to hit install install anyways so let me just tap on install anyways now it's saying here this website is trying to download a configuration file do you want to allow this so i'm going to say yes allow this okay profile downloaded review the profile in settings app if you want to install it so now that the profile has been downloaded let's go back to the home screen and then what we will do is go to settings then on the left hand side here we are going to say something that says profile downloaded so let's tap on that now this is going to ask us to install it we're going to tap on install here so let me just tap install now it's going to ask for verification for our passcode so let me just put this in okay now what we've got here is some more terms and conditions and such but we've also got an install button so i'm going to just tap on install and then tap on install once again now at this point it's saying here restart required so what i'm going to do now is restart my ipad Okay, so my iPad is now rebooted, and what I've also done here is to make sure that it is connected to the internet. It has to be connected to the internet, because what it is going to do now is to download an operating system file. So what we need to do is tap on settings, then in settings, go to general. Then once we're in general, tap on software update. Now that should refresh, there we go. As we can see there, iPad OS 16 developer beta. So what I'm going to do now is tap on download and install and then tap in my security code. Okay. Give that a moment there. It's just going to go and get the link. There we go. So we're going to have a bunch of terms and conditions and such and whatnot. I'm just going to agree to that and then click agree again. Okay, and as we can see there, it is now indicating that it is downloading the file. I'm not entirely sure how long this is going to take. This is going to be down to your internet connection and stuff. Okay, so with that all said, I am now just going to jump to the point where I've installed this software. Okay, so I've now finally got to the point where it's done the download and whatnot. That must have took close to 20 minutes now. That will be dependent upon web speed and stuff like that, but it still took a fair bit of time to unpack the files. So what I'm going to do now is tap on install now. Let's see, verify and update. Just give it a second. Let's see what's going on here. I'll try and do this bit now in real time to give you a really good idea of how long it's going to take from this point. Um, okay, so that's now switched off. So the iPad is now going to reboot up here. So I'll probably flash through this bit. There we go. We've just seen the Apple logo. I'm just assuming that this is definitely just a normal restart. Yeah, there we go. Okay, and as we can see now, it has actually restarted. It has gone back to the Apple logo. And as we can see here, it's got an indicator here, which is showing us how much time it's going to take to install from this point. Now, I think this might actually take a few more minutes. So what I will do now is I will just go speeding through this until we get past this point. Okay, so yeah, it did just do a restart. And as we can see, we are now on the Apple logo and we've got this indicator bar here, which is going to like give us an indication of how long it's going to take from this point to install now that does look like it might take a little bit of time so i will indeed jump through this bit until we get to the next section 
Okay, so as you can see there, I have now got through to the final part of the installation. So let me get to my home screen and I'll explain how long this has taken me. Okay, so I'm onto the home screen now and I would have to say at this point, the whole process has taken maybe just over half an hour to do, okay? So that should give you a rough idea, maybe somewhere between 30 to 35 minutes. So what happened when I first instigated the download for the operating system and then the unpacking element, I would say that probably took around 20 minutes, something like that. And then when it switched off and then restarted itself twice over and it does restart twice over and those indicator bars don't necessarily go right to the end when it does that but that section in order to take us right back to the start of the iPad now to the actual home screen that was maybe a little over 10 minutes so like I say in total somewhere in the region of 30 to 35 minutes to do the entire installation anyway what I'm gonna do now is just tap on settings I'm gonna go to general and then I will go to about and as we can see there, iPad OS version 16. Or to be more precise, iPad OS 16 developer beta. Okay, so there we have it then. That should do it for this video. And once again, just to be dead clear and dead boring about it, back up your iPad and then at least you've got something to go back to if you don't like this. And let's face it, these are still beta downloads and stuff like that. So there's probably a lot of things wrong with them. Anyways, if you've liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. Also consider subscribing to my channel, getting all over that bell notification icon. I'm David Harry. Thank you very much for watching this video. Take care and goodbye now.